Good morning, everybody. Um, we're gonna do a little bit of maintenance today and fix a couple things. Um, last time when I went out, one of my bunks on the trailer broke, so um, we're gonna do a little bit of welding today, put in some new bolts for the bunks, and also it seems like the bilge pump has a leak in it. So we're gonna try and address all those today. Got my pops coming over in a little bit. But, yep, do some grinding, some welding, and uh, see if we can get her back ready for the water and uh, get out there and do some more fishing. Hope you enjoy watching, see how we do things, and come along for the ride. All right. Okay, so now we're just gonna let this dry up and then we're just gonna hit it with a little black spray paint just so it doesn't rust and we'll call this good. And then we'll move on to some of the other bolts that have come out or loose and uh, we'll try and tighten up the, the bolts on all the bunks. So we tracked down the leak and it was coming from the bilge pump hose and uh, it's got a crack in it. But in order to replace that hose, it goes through a firewall or wall down here and there's just no access to it. So it goes all the way through over here the wall and then out through here 
and because we couldn't get through that wall there's just no way I was gonna tear up the entire floor in order to replace that hose so we ran a new hose off the bilge pump if you can see it I'm not sure you can see the new hose there and we ran it out and over and that was to eliminate having to take the entire floor apart so just finishing up here um, finished up the bilge pump and uh, that's all taken care of so shouldn't have no more leaks and uh, we welded up the one bracket that was broken put a new bolt in on the front bunk or front right bunk and then just tighten down the other bolts they were all a little loose but um something to be said if you own a tracker um i think this is a, a 175 tracker um if you have to replace that line for the bilge pump i think you got to take the whole floor apart and um, um i'm not even sure how to start it and go about it um, yeah, the whole thing's riveted down uh, I know it, it'd be quite the process but um, but this was a good alternative and uh, it'll work great won't have no issues with it and yep so we can get back out there on the water probably won't be fishing this weekend got a couple things I need to do but next weekend um, I'm sure we'll be out there so Hope you guys uh, have fun fishing out there and we'll see you on the water.